On the island of Phuket, there is one species that is native to this area. That's the white-handed or the lar gibbon. These gibbons can be identified by the white markings on the tops of their hands, the tops of their feet, and the ring around their face. There are three other species of gibbon that are native to Thailand. Two of these you would be able to see here at our center if you come to visit. The pileated gibbon and the agile gibbon. These species are non-native to Phuket, which means because they're here at our center, they are unable to be part of the rehabilitation process because the forests of Phuket are not conducive to living for those animals. The only species that can be released into the Khao Prateo non-hunting zone is the white-handed gibbon. The fourth species of gibbon is the siamang. They are the largest of the four species. They range from 10 to 12 kilograms, as opposed to the other three gibbon species, which are about five to six kilograms. Siamangs are also the most endangered gibbon species, and they are the rarest to be found in Thailand. In total, there are approximately 21 species of gibbon all around Asia, and they can only be found in Asia. They range from India to China, all the way south to Indonesia. On the island of Phuket, the only species that you will be able to possibly see is the white-handed gibbon in the wild, here in the Khao Prateo non-hunting zone. Sadly, the forest area of this non-hunting site is only about 4% of the total size of the island of Phuket, which means the space for releasing families of gibbons is quite small. We do what we can here at the center, but ultimately at the end of the day, with the number of gibbons that we have here, they will run out of space in the non-hunting area for release of multiple families. As a result, the Wild Animal Rescue Foundation of Thailand is working diligently to find and secure other sites of forest area that is protected around Thailand in order to continue to release gibbon families in other places around the country. One of these locations is up near Chiang Mai. The Gibbon Rehabilitation Project is working in close contact with the local community in order for them to monitor and work alongside the project to keep the families that they've released up there safe and ensure that they are having a successful reintroduction process.